Hi guys, so I've just done my let's have a chat and address a few things video, pardon me, um, I have loads of packages here that I have just recently got through, I've still got loads underneath the desk but these ones have got a lot of baby stuff in so we're going to open these ones because I'm dead excited about them, um, obviously as you know my baby's due in May so I've been buying stuff for it, um, I've basically got everything that I need now, just need to buy a baby swing rocker thing, um, I think that's it actually, um, but anyway, so yeah, I've just bought a few knick-knacky bits off of June, so, um, we shall see what I have through, um, and then it will get back to the normal routine of opening the ones that are underneath the desk. <laughs> um, still got loads of wish ones as well. Oh, my bum's going a bit numb. So I have got my throw around me because it is very cold. And this is a very nice, um, like, duck egg kind of colour throw. Um, and it's just very, very nice and warm. Okay, so we shall start with this one. This is a um, stroller safe console tray. This is what the piece of paper says that comes in it. Now you could get this in a variety of different colours but because we know that we are having a boy I've decided to go with a very nice blue and I think it will match the push chair very nicely let's just get rid of that so this is oh the quality is actually pretty good i did um obviously there's lots of different sellers and um quite a few different sellers sell these so i read the reviews first before i bought this one sorry about the rustling so it attaches onto the push chair with these velcro strips here you obviously put it over the handle of the push chair put this through there and velcro round so you have two on each side so um, it sits like that in between the um, I've got a handle that is a all-in-one handle not two handles so it would sit in the middle of it like that so what you get is you get two cup holders which will be handy for my drink and a baby's bottle or if um, baby doesn't need his bottle then me and my partner's drink when we both go out together um, it's got a part in here at the top that does up and undoes and it's got a uh, it's very spacious actually so my partner can put his phone in there and play Pokemon Go on the way whilst we're pushing and it also has a bigger compartment at the front here which you can just put I don't know stuff in so the quality of this is actually really good and as you can see the zips work fine um, some people said that theirs came with marks uh, this has got absolutely no marks on it whatsoever um, I'm very happy with this product actually and I, I can't wait to put it on on the push chair and use it so that was our first product let me just put it in here so well see if I can get it back in here so it stays nice and protected As you can see, that's how it will sit. So yeah, so that's pretty good. Um, I paid two pound for that. I was very happy with that. Okay, so let's go on to the next thing. All right. Now, some bottles that I've got I haven't got teats because. Um, I've bought a lot of bottles brand new, but there were some um, man, man bottles that I managed to get um, second hand and they didn't come with teats. Um, so 
on June you can get teats. So I've got five of these ones. Um, I haven't tried them in the bottle yet, which I will do after this video. Um, if they don't fit in that bottle, I know that they definitely will fit in some other bottles that I have. Um, these are actually pretty good quality. I was a bit skeptical about them coming in. As you can see, they simulate nipple. Um, yeah, as I was saying, I, I was quite skeptical about what the quality was going to be like. But these are just like the ones that you would buy in the shops for. Um, well, I was in Asda the other day. Uh, and a pack of two was something like £4.95 and these were a pound each so I bought five just to um, see what they would be like so I'm very happy with these very happy so obviously I spent five pounds because they were a pound each and I got five but no, those are brilliant, really good quality. And they do different size ones as well, like different size, neck sizes. Um, so if any of you guys are looking for a replacement teat and don't want to spend an absolute fortune in your local shop, then yeah. And they came through really quickly as well. I think they only took something like maybe four days to come through. So I was really surprised about that. Um, they're really good. I'm really happy with those. Let's go. Oh. So this is a. Um, sorry for the rustling. This is a nursing bra. Um, because I plan on expressing um, for the baby. Um, oh goodness me bear with me a second so I got this in like a peachy colour um, I paid £1.88 for this it was in the deal of the hour um, and I did see that um, I mean I only saved myself a couple of pence in the deal of the hour because some of them were going for £2 some of them were going for £3 so this was £1.88 um, this is a 36 80 I think this I don't I'm not sure if this is oh no it doesn't look like it's going to be too big so the material on this is very nice hold on a minute I look really silly right now don't I can I clip it bear with me okay so obviously I'm not going to show you this uh, without my t-shirt on because, you know. So it's got adjustable straps here. Nice thick straps. Um, so obviously adjustable. Oh, I didn't adjust that one well enough. So actually this is going to fit nicely. And it's got these two poppers here that you just unpop. And if you want to breastfeed, then obviously you whip your nip nips out and you can breastfeed. But this is going to do just as well for expressing. Um, it feels very comfy over my t-shirt, even though I'm not going to be wearing it over my t-shirt. Obviously, I'll be wearing it under my t-shirt. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm really happy with this. You could get it in um, three different colours. I think it was like grey, white and peach and I've gone for the peach and um, yeah it's got very it's got nice wide straps at the side um, hold on a minute let me take it off and show you oh gosh you could almost forget that you're wearing that over your t-shirt you know so it's got nice wide straps at the side and it's got a nice thick dewy uppy uh, claspy bit here with three different settings so yeah I'm, I'm I'm actually quite happy with that I might have to get myself another one I only ordered one because I didn't know what the quality was going to be like and if it would fit or not but as it's just in it will fit and the quality is very nice <laughs> excuse me um, 
Have I opened that yet? Okay. So this one is um, for all you mummies out there that... Um, hold on a minute, I just need my blanket back because I'm getting cold again. So um, I don't know if you've heard of the Hacker and the Nutri... Nutri bond. Um, it's almost like a manual breast pump um, with its own suction. So I was going through June and I found exactly the same thing for just a little bit cheaper. So it comes with a lid. I chose a yellow lid. You could get green, pink, um, like it was a minty green, um, like a baby pink. I think there was blue and obviously a yellow one you could also get ones without the lid but i thought same price might as well get one with the lid so this is exactly like the nutri bonds and the hackers as you can see it is a silicon um start uh, a silicon thing i don't know what you call it um it has the measurements at the side there and it's got a very nice little detail on it. So what you do with this is obviously, I haven't got much fat on my arm, but imagine this is your boob, you would like suction it onto your boob and it would get like your let down um, or you could just like, if you're expressing on one side or feeding on one side, you could use this on the other side and you just like squeeze it like that. And obviously it sits with your nipple going in there and the milk will come out and then, you can put your lid on it so that the milk doesn't get spilt before you transfer it into either another bottle or your milk storage bags. So I'm very happy with this. I can't remember, I paid like two or three pound for this. Um, and like the normal hacker or Nutri bonds are like quite more expensive than that. But this is exactly the same thing and had very good reviews. So I thought, why not? I have obviously got, um, a couple of electric pumps um, and I thought I really want to give this one a go as well so yeah obviously I can't do a review on this just yet but when baby is here in May I will do a review on it I know it's, it's a little while but I shall do that okay Sorry, I have got a little heater on down here and I don't want my lovely throw to um, uh, sit on it and set a light. <laughs> Stroller bottle pocket. Okay, so as you saw, I ordered that um, uh, uh, push chair organizer tray thing. I also ordered this, um, which is for a single drink. It is a thermos one. It has got the thermal bit inside. So if I've got a warm bottle of milk, I can put it in there. Or yet again, I can put my own drink in there. And this does onto the push chair exactly the same as the other one does. It has Velcro here, a nice thick Velcro strap, and it goes, through this hair, that little um, buckle thing, and you put it around the handle of your push chair, and it will sit there like that so that you can put your drink in it. It also has this netting here where you can put your phone or a dummy or whatever, I guess. Um, yet again, the quality of this is really good. I only paid a couple of pounds for these, but they were going on there for up to like eight pounds. I thought I'm not spending eight pound on one, I'll just spend a couple of pounds and see what it's like. Um, so yeah, I'm really happy with that. That's another thing that your mums should get because it will probably be helpful. As you can see, somebody's put a, looks like a Subway drink and their phone in the holder. So yeah. Yet again, something else I'm excited to use. When it comes to baby stuff though, I mean, come on. Who wouldn't be excited to use it? Okay.
these are just two hooks for the push chair so I can put my shopping um, and my shop shopping or just like uh, a handbag or something um, on the um, on the handle now when I was looking at these some people were selling them at one each for a pound but I managed to get two for a pound and what it is is just another velcro um, thing there that you put around the handle of the push chair and then you just clip that like that and obviously you put your your shopping in it your shopping bag will hang have I got a bag and to so say like I wanted to put this on the handle oh shit sorry sugar so say I wanted to put this on the handle I would um, do that like that and then it would be like that on the push chair I have got um, slightly bigger ones of these coming um, because when I got these through I did think oh they're a little bit small but they're still going to be usable um, but I have got a very big one um, coming in the post as well so they were two for a pound so guys if you want any of those I suggest that you have a look have a look through and don't get just one for a pound make sure that it says two and uh, yeah so happy with that as well goodness me it's all building up up here now okay um, I have a couple of things that no that's what I've just put back isn't it um, I have a couple of things that um, aren't baby related as well so we may as well just do sorry that's my phone vibrating so we might as well just quickly do those now as well so whoops oh dear me um, these are a pack of nail drills um, get down there okay so that's not going to get down so this is a pack of one two three four five six nail drill parts and um, like sandpaper parts at the top there and what you do with those is um, obviously with the gel nails um, you can use say this this one here that's decided to hang about at the top you would use that just to take the first layer off so that um, you can prep it just to do your second layer of um, of uh, oh, what's it called um, the gel stuff before you obviously paint it uh, the builder the gel builder so can I get into this it's got sellotape on it got a feeling that I might send these flying everywhere well you can see in the packet what they're like I have got a nail tool so I shall give those a go at some point and I shall tell you whether they're good or not oh this box is very squashed so this is a Sorry, this is a um, matte wear liquid foundation. It's by Miss Ro Rose or Ross um, in beige three. And on the back it says combination to oily skin, buildable coverage, suitable for sensitive skin, oil free, no comedigen, whatever that is. Smooth on foundation for perfectly flawless matte finish. Uh, on the side here it has the ingredients and then on that side there it's got loads of other writing so you could get this in beige one two or three and I got it in beige three this is what the tube looks like um, but I do have to say in the bottle it looks a bit like a different colour 
So let's have a look. So, oh, hmm. It's not too bad, but I think I might have got slightly the wrong colour. So yeah, see what that's like going over tattoo a little bit. So I've just put the tiniest little bit on the tattoo there. And that's it, partly rubbed in. Not rubbed in properly, but partly. It smells absolutely lovely though. I might have to go back and get one of the different beiges um, to see if that looks better on my skin. Because otherwise, I think I might end up looking a bit orange. Oh dear, I'm running out of drink. Okay. So that was that, wasn't it? Ah, nice. So, the person who does my nails absolutely loves butterflies. And um, I saw these, so I ordered them and thought that they might look nice in um, the salon. So it's just a pack of butterflies. Um, I can't remember how many you get in the packet, but it's a combination of big ones and small ones, and they've got a small magnet on the back so that they can magnetise to things. I can't remember if it was a pack of 20 or a pack of 12. I'll have to go back and have a look. But I got them in the pinky purpley colour. You could get them in loads of other different colours. And obviously when you go to put them up, you can squeeze the um, wings a little bit so it does actually look like that they're sticking out and flying. So, I'll have to remember that I've got those and take those down at some point. And I think this is the last thing that I have up here. Because that's eBay. That's from which ages ago? Uh, so yeah, okay. So I think this is the last thing that I have up here at the minute. And this is the um, Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. Um, and obviously you just put this um, on your eyelids um, just to make um, eye, uh, different colours of eyeshadow stand out a little bit. So this is the original one and it comes with a top like that. Oh, that seemed very runny. Bear with me a minute. I don't know if I have to shake this first, but I just got a lot of clear, some clear liquid then. So let's just give this a quick shake and a putty put around like that. I know the colour's coming up. So that's what it comes out at and uh hold on a minute let's just get this brush here and then you'd put it on your eyelids uh just do that with it a little bit and then put your eyeshadow on the top but i do have to say that clear liquid came out first and uh i think you just have to give it a little shimmy shimmy shake before you do that yeah okay i need to wipe that off my hand it smells okay um i'm gonna have to give it a shake before i use it but yeah so that was just a few things that i got through recently as i said i've still got loads of stuff underneath the desk from wish and from june but i was a little bit excited to open this stuff because it was baby stuff so I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you to all of my subscribers. I think I'm on 371 at the minute. Um, so yeah, cheers for subscribing guys and sticking with me. I very much appreciate it because I know I'm not very consistent with my videos. Um, but as you are all aware, I do have some issues and stuff that make it so that I'm not 100% consistent. Um, but I do try my best and um, every, every week I'm trying a little bit harder so 
keep safe guys keep happy keep your family close and i shall um see you all very soon much love to you bye